Well, earlier this month in the northern Nigerian town of Baga, fierce fighting between Boko Haram Islamists and soldiers left a trail of death and destruction. Or did it? It seems the answer depends on who you ask. These pictures show the remote fishing town of Baga after fighting between Boko Haram Islamists and a multinational military force on April 19th. The Red Cross says 187 people died in the violence. Local Senator Maina Lawan says the death toll's even higher. He says he counted more than 200 bodies and at least 4,000 destroyed homes. Nigeria's foreign minister told Arise News these reports are exaggerated. It is true there was clash between, it was a multinational force made up of Nigerian soldiers, Chadian soldiers, Nigerian soldiers and Cameroonian soldiers. So all these were the ones that were involved in the uh, clash that happened. Of course, when you have a multinational force like that trying to contain a terrorist group, you will have collateral damage, which is probably what happened in Bagia. But government is concerned and government has uh, set up an inquiry to look into what happened really in Bagia. The government's senior investigator also spoke to the media. He also says the death toll's been exaggerated. One house or thousands? Well, the government's investigator's words are at odds with eyewitness accounts and with these photographs from the scene.